Head Stepper Stop Studios, yours truly, King Swing, John Seekers. That was my intro. My assistant right here. It don't really matter, I'm joking. It's, 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 it's Alexis, you know what I'm saying? All right, so one of the things we're talking about uh, tonight, I wanted to explain something. I was explaining to the students about a particular movie, uh, the Tuck Turn Pack. In our community, we do it several different ways. One in particular way that I see a lot of people do it, uh, I'm going to demonstrate with Alexis. And I'm also going to break down the history of where this move come from so everybody can have a full understanding of why it's being done this way. So first, I'm going to move for those bases. Y'all doing the bases? I see in our community is this. Right. Cool. Cool. So let me break down what what that is, right? And also when the ladies do that, you have just changed the basic six or eight count step pattern to an extended count pattern. It's very important for us to understand what that is as well. All right, so what happens is in our community, the men allow the woman to get their style and do their thing. The thing is, this is the thing, this, this tuck turn pattern is known throughout several different forms of swing dance. Uh, pretty much all of them, right? It's a swing dance move. The difference is when you see the ladies doing the extra, this part came, this, this, this is a form of hijack. Right? This actually comes from West Coast. So, on the West Coast, what you would see, here, she would literally take over. As you can see, she's holding my arm up there, and she's doing her own thing, and then she's gonna come out. Right? That is the difference between the two moves. So, regular tuck turn pattern. Right, I can do it from a closed position. version of the tuck turn pattern, where she's holding my arm up, right, taking over the move, right? So then we have the swing out version, modified version of the tuck turn, where the leads just raise the arm up and let the woman do the thing. So the thing is, regardless of what you're doing or how you do it, it's important for you to understand the history and knowledge behind the moves. I know where they come from. So if anyone asks you, you'll have a general understanding of it. From yours truly, King Swing.